Colchicine is an anti-inflammatory medication used to treat acute gout attacks as well as pericarditis. In this mnemonic video, we'll cover important facts about colchicine so you'll be ready if you see it come test day. It's Super Bowl game day and the coach is on the field watching the players run through the tunnel. By the way, this coach will serve as your memory anchor to colchicine because coach kind of sounds like colchicine. You can even think of it as colchicine, if that helps. Let's move on to talk more about how colchicine works and what it's used for. It's the first Super Bowl for this football player and running into the stadium full of people made him feel super nervous. In his anxiety, he tripped and bumped into a pyrotechnic flaming display, causing a spectator's poster to catch on fire. Oh no, good thing the coach here knew where the closest fire extinguisher was. Here at Pixarize, we use a fire extinguisher as our recurring symbol for anti-inflammatory drugs. Because just like the fire extinguisher puts out flames, colchicine is used to put out inflammation. Got that? Let's move on. As the football player tripped, he stubbed his toe really badly. Yep, see how big and swollen that toe has gotten? Oof, that's gotta hurt. This stubbed toe should help you remember gout, or rather the finding of podagra, or a massive inflamed big toe in gout. You see, colchicine is used clinically to treat gout, particularly for stopping an acute gout attack. It's worth noting that colchicine is not taken beforehand to prevent gout. There are other medications for chronic management and prevention of gout. No, instead, colchicine is given after a painful gout attack has already developed to reduce the inflammation and hopefully relieve some of the pain. It's common for people to also need to take NSAIDs along with colchicine for better pain control. Just remember this football player who's currently in a lot of pain from his stubbed toe to remember that colchicine is given for acute gout attacks. I mentioned earlier that the fire is catching a fan's poster on fire. Notice that this poster has a big heart on it. One of those I heart this player posters, you know? Use this heart going up in flames to remind you of pericarditis. Let me explain. Pericarditis is inflammation of the heart, specifically of the pericardium or the sac-like membrane that surrounds the heart. So this heart going up in flames can remind you of inflammation around the heart, right? In addition to gout, colchicine may be used to treat acute inflammation seen in pericarditis. Okay, with the clinical uses out of the way, let's end by talking about one major side effect of colchicine. The player is feeling so nervous for the big game that he's even feeling a little nauseous. His nausea is what caused him to trip in the first place. This nauseous player is here to help you remember that colchicine can cause GI distress. Nausea is probably the most common symptom, but other symptoms include diarrhea, vomiting, and abdominal pain. Colchicine can be taken with food to try to reduce or lessen this gastrointestinal discomfort. All right, that's all for this mnemonic. Let's recap and get to the game. Colchicine is an anti-inflammatory medication that is used to reduce inflammation, treating acute gout attacks and pericarditis. The biggest side effect to know is gastrointestinal distress. Colchicine may be taken with food to relieve GI discomfort. And now we're done with colchicine. Focus up, you're running out of that tunnel next. See you next time. Thanks for watching. For more videos like this one, subscribe to our channel and check out our newest lessons. For more resources on this topic, including fact lists and interactive review images, click the image next to the more here arrow. I'll see you next time.